I'm videoing dealing with church and some lovely countryside on the 10th of June. It's going to be turned into a gym, is that? Nice clock up there, but it's three days on there. You used to have eight bells in that. Going on there, like magic. Don't worry about the noise, it's all being scaffolded at the moment. That's Wayne House Tower over there. Hang on. A bit breezy, a bit cold. Um. Not working clock. Three clock faces on this one, one white and the skeleton one. Hey, that's a coil bong. Bring. Harry Potter's Hogwarts is this. That's what they're doing, Hogwarts. <clears throat> what is it meant to be? Is it a tube? It's like a wind chime, is that? Sound of a wind chime. Let's go this side and video up there. Put this on for my mate Graham because he likes churches and chapels. This is because we're still in a bit of lockdown. So hopefully it'll be fixed soon. It looks nice that I've cleaned this church. Um, I'm going to go around the other side in a minute. Let's see what's over there. Up there, up right on that hill is Emily Moore Mass, where my friend lives. Yeah, they're doing a good job. Well done. Excellent. I like that one up there. I'm going to have to go to the next castle grounds. So I'm going to have to go around the other side and see this side now. This clock face is another clock there, but it's a white one. I don't really listen to that. That way there's no one on YouTube, it's just sound. Right. I don't say I need to go down there and get the clock. Video the clock face, Mabel. I need to go down. Down there I'm going to walk. Just stay there. This is for Graham, my private friend, who I see every now and again. So this is like welcome to Hogwarts, Harry Potter's um, castle grounds. My favourite program. Right. Now I think you can go down there. There's a passageway down there to the next. Well, let's have a look. Just don't video anybody on YouTube. I won't. I'm going to go video this church before they make it into a flat and a gym. Look after this program now. 
Where is it? Oh, uh, it's there at the back. Right, it's on. It's a bit uploaded. Right. Oh yeah, I can get it up there. That's this is Illingworth Church. That's what we're doing now, which is a shame of that. Looks better they've cleaned it up. Used to have a peel of eight bells in there at one time, but I wasn't born then when they had them. So, so we're up by Illingworth. So we'll look by when you look down there isn't it? Keithley via Halifax down here and then you want to have a look. Um let's see. That's oh, just a bus passing by. Um, what's this? Let's have a look and see a bit, a bit high up on the hill is that? Oh, let me just see if I can get around the other side. Okay. Let me think about it. Looks nice I've cleaned it up. Looks very nice. Yes. <laughs> right, how do we get up there? That's the other side. Right, just saw you come up. Now we need to. Well, it costs to twelve, so. This was done at just after 11 o'clock in the morning on the 10th of June. On Thursday morning, this was done in the summer months. And I cleaned all the walls down, so that looks lovely. So, let's see if there's a passageway up there. I don't know if we can get up there or not. It's like a chapel. Yeah, I understand. It's a shame they're making it into houses. It still looks nice as a little church. Then we could have some bells put back in there. Well, yeah, I think so. Let's give it another tour, and then I'll move somewhere different. So I'm in a, like a little main road village area. And up there is on that hill is Emily Moore Mass, right up there. Um maybe I might have another idea to get that church bell tower. Sorry. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I need to stop where I'm at. 
Right, let's get this church. If I stand up here, I think I've got my room to get the clock tower. Right, off we go. Let's carry on a little longer. It's just because of men working up there, but I'm not videoing them on YouTube. So, it's got three clock faces. But hopefully it should be working soon. Don't worry about the wagon. All my bell ringing friends will think, oh, well, what's that, Stuart? Ah, there's some more work up there. videoing the church tower because it's nice it's a nice little church it reminds me of um, Wilmslow in Dab in um, in Cheshire Wilmslow's tower look up there so what we're gonna do is gonna give it another video and then I'm going somewhere different I'm uh, just checking. Where's the other side, Stuart? Um, just there. I'll get the other side of the building before we move on. This is history about churches and chapels and redundant churches from Graham. I'm still at the other side of Halifax. I'm near Ogden Water, which is way over that way. Hey, it's hard work. It's very hard work. Right. So it's only got three clock faces on here, uh, two skeleton ones and one white one around the other side of the winter clock. So, so don't worry, we're not videoing anyone, only the church. But it's been made into um, a gym, which is a shame. It should still have its bells in there, which is a real shame, isn't it? But it looks nice that they've cleaned it, because last time I came up here it was black. Not as black as Halifax Minster, but pale black. Yeah, so it looks nice now, it, it stands out more does that, yeah, so I'll give you that, that's a bonus, yes, so up there is a passageway to the Gryffindor, up to the country church, so I can turn, that's a bird, right, please watch the main road, because this is the main road that it's on. And that's the main road down there, take it to back to Halifax and Keefley, so we just have to watch the main road because it's a bit dangerous. Mm. Right, let's go back and do it again and then I'm going to stop. Two seconds. Here I am. We've got some nice countryside through Halifax Pelham Way. Why? It's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Hmm. 
There's the clock. I've done round the other side, so that's done. <coughs> so that's it now. That's done now, so we'll leave that as it is.